Hi guys, um, I'm going to be showing you how to do the box stitch, which looks like this. And the things you're going to be needing are two pieces of bunagle, any color you want. And they can be a yard or arm's length. So what you're going to do is you're going to fold them in half. And find their center. So I found my center of the orange and the green piece of bundle. Um, you're gonna try and hold it like this. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna try and cross them. So you can kind of see my two pieces of bundle are crossed. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold um, that down. So you can kind of see that my strings are opposite from each other. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take um, the bottom strand that's under the orange, you're going to take that strand first and you're going to go over. So you're going to go over, here let me hold it like this, you're going to go over so you just made a loop. That's your first loop. You can kind of even see it. Now you're going to get the other um, color, which is the same color as the one you just did a loop. And you're going to do another loop. So, as you can tell, you have two loops. So you can actually tell right here that you have a tail here and a loop here. So it just depends on which way you did it. But... There has to be a tail and a loop. So, what you're going to do is grab the strand if it's next to the tail. You're going to grab that one. Go over the tail in the loop. Just like that. Pull the strand all the way through. So, you just went over under. Now you're going to do the same thing with the strand, the same color you just strung through. Now there's a tail here and a loop here. I'm going to go over the tail in the loop and pull it. So that's how you start the box stitch. Um, you're going to grab it and start pulling it and it's going to make a box stitch, just like that. And um, once you do the next stitch, it's going to lock it in place. So do the same te technique I showed you. You can just hold it like this, or if you can kind of tell, you can kind of hold it like this and hold on to one of the strands. What you're going to do is you're gonna get this next strand and make a loop. So you can kind of tell your, this strand's going over, so back the way it was to make a loop, just like that. Grab the green strand and put it over, and you just made two loops. See? Now I'm gonna grab the strand that's closer to the loop, so my orange, I'm gonna go over the tail into this loop and just pull it. Make sure your strands are not knotted. Now you're gonna grab the other strand that's closer to that this tail. I'm gonna go over the tail in the loop. Pull that. And now you just pull. And there is your second box stitch. You can kind of tell it's starting to form. So yeah. I'm going to do one more stitch for you guys. And then you guys are kind of on your own to do your bunal. And if you want, you can just re-watch this video. Or you can just, you know, if I didn't, you didn't understand how I did it. You can definitely go ahead and watch someone else's video if you like. So, I'm going to 
do it with the orange strand, this third stitch. So you're going to put over your strand to make a loop. So there's two loops here. I'm going to grab this green because this is closer to this tail as you can tell. I'm going to over the tail in the loop. Okay, just like that. Now you're going to grab the other string, which is the green one obviously. I'm going to go over the tail in the loop. And just go ahead and pull that together. And you just made your third box stitch. Now, I'm sorry if this tutorial um, didn't really help. Um, I was really struggling on how to do this tutorial, like how to show you guys, and I figured it out. So I hope this helped. Um, you wouldn't have understand if I did it the other way, if like, I filmed it, so I just did it this way. So I hope you guys understood this, and comment down below if you didn't understand and I could help you, or if you found another video of a box stitch, maybe theirs is, you know, better. Yeah. So that's your box stitch. The next video I'm going to show you how to do is the circle stitch.